The project that we have developed with the Education District is called IT at School. It is linked to a project called Erasmus Plus, in which four centers participate. Ours, IES, Emilio Alarcos, which is the coordinator, The Hague, another from Budapest, and one from Mole, Belgium. The project aims to develop digital competence in both the students and teachers from the different centers. We used the Education District as a repository. We created a showroom in which the digital products that the children have created over this two-year project's meetings have been uploaded. All of the projects, presentations, videos, audio, images, etc., are in this space that was created within the Education District. The goal of this project, Erasmus Plus, is to develop digital competence in both the students and teachers. In particular, the Education District has helped the boys and girls involved to develop their digital competence. It has also helped them work on their linguistic skills, since they've had to communicate in English, the official language of the project, as well as learn and work in groups. It is a platform that allows for the development of all these skills. The reaction of the students involved here in Spain and in the rest of the countries has been excellent. It is a strong motivator that has made them interested in working. Seeing how the projects they create appear in this space greatly motivates them as well. It also gives them the opportunity to develop their own creativity by leaving them room so that they are the ones who create the space. The Erasmus Plus project also involves the e-twinning project, which has a space where we upload all the resources and materials. The fundamental difference in the Education District is that they have created their own virtual three-dimensional world in which each person enters with their own avatar and can directly interact with the rest of their peers. We have used the Education District as a showroom. We have also used the Bricks application that highly motivates them since it looks a lot like Minecraft which many of the students have already used. It is mostly used to upload all the products created, but I particularly like the idea that the students are the content producers and creators of this virtual world. In addition to a showroom, it also allows for gamification. The fact that they can compete, create their own games and competition, and that there is a functionality is very interesting to me. It is also interesting that they can work on their oral skills through presentations that they can perform in real time in this virtual world. Personally, it seems that this platform of Education District is very useful to the teachers since it allows us students to create what we have in our heads from scratch. It also allows people who are thousands of kilometers away from each other to talk and work together, creating strong bonds between people from different countries who have no other way to communicate with each other besides the internet, such as in this case. It also makes it possible to work in a more comfortable, easier and fun way ensuring that you learn a lot more this way than you would in traditional ways.